Hiding under that grass, there's a uh, sickle bar mower, sickle knife, and it's mowing now. If you observe, I'm going to show you what it looks like when it starts and stops. The teeth are running now. They're stopped. They're running. They're stopped. They're running. They're stopped. That's a sickle mower. It's This one's a tractor sickle bar mower. It's a three-point hitch mower attached to a small tractor. This the sickle technology uh, was invented long before tractors were. This is what a standard horse-drawn <clears throat> mower worked like before tractors were invented. Now there has been some evolution to them. Uh, this particular mower is uh, uh, uses a, a newly designed a German knife. Uh, that's highly energy efficient and doesn't clog as easily as old-fashioned sickle mowers did. The one-horse mower that I'm uh, hoping to buy for my donkeys to have modified to be pulled by two donkeys instead of one horse uses this exact same sickle knife as this particular tractor drawn mower, it's highly efficient, as I said earlier. Oops. And this is what happens when you pay too much attention to videotaping and not enough attention to farming. So I'm going to shut this off and get out of this mess, and then uh, I'll tell the rest of the story that goes with this video later. Bye. <laughs> This clip is from another day mowing uh, uh, cross ditch, mowing you know road edge ditch, ditch fronts. Um, the point of this process, the point of this mower, is that if I were doing this with uh, donkeys instead of a tractor, I would be harvesting this grass without any uh, uh, fossil fuel-based emissions, immediate emissions. Obviously, there's embedded energy in the mower itself. But the point is, when when one harvests grass like this, one is, is harvesting uh, atmospheric carbon. That's about 50% atmospheric carbon. And when it's cut like that and left, uh, uh, funguses and bacteria return that carbon to the soil. So this is a carbon sequestration project. Once again, if I were doing this powered by a team of donkeys, then uh, this would be, uh, 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 in the doing, it would be in 100% sequestration with no carbon cost, uh, no continuing carbon cost. Uh, Tractor-mounted sickle mowers like this are behind you, as you can see the tobacco wheel you're looking at there. So to mow is one of these, you have to, to drive with your wreck. Uh, head <coughs> turned back, you know, twisted around all day. Uh, a a drawn, horse drawn sickle mower, the, the sickle knife is right beside the uh, driver uh, because the drive mechanism is more space efficient. And uh, so you don't have to um, be looking behind you all the time you can look a little closer to yourself and it's not quite so hard on the neck the noises that you hear in this video are a combination of, of uh, this little diesel three cylinder diesel tractor's engine and also the, the mower knife if I were doing this with the donkeys, I'd have the mower knife to deal with the more knife noise, but I wouldn't have the tractor uh, engine noise. Um, the, this uh, German-made knife, is the, the company that makes this knife doesn't make mowers. They just make these knives and sell them to mower manufacturers. <clears throat> the mower that you're looking at here is an Italian-made mower. Uh, it's, it's attached to a John Deere 790 tractor. 
um, by it, be it three point hitch run off the PTO. Uh, a donkey powered mower is ground driven by the by the uh, forward motion of the wheels through the donkey strength. So it's kind of the same process, but a little bit different. And uh, this is uh, my objective for for uh, uh, the future is to get donkey powered and to not have to waste all this fuel to do this.